Greetings, special centurions, and welcome, fellow YouTubers, back to Oblivion. We are currently just east of the Imperial City, exploring Fort Major. We've only just entered, so we have no idea what's going to be awaiting us, but let's continue. Oh, what's that? Is that a ghost? It looks like a ghost. Yeah, it's a ghost. So we have undead chat. Looks like lots of undead. I don't have any silver weaponry on me either. Well, Bruce Safamelian sword might be a silver weapon, actually. But it does frost. Yeah, it looks silver. Unfortunately, it does frost damage. And ghosts are resistant to frost. ancient ghost as well. Might have to archer this one down so we can dodge. Let's get in there. So it turns out Brusa Familian's sword is a silver weapon. So that's good. It'll be good for fighting undead. Just not ghosts. Die, ghost! Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
The other problem with it is because it's magic, we don't quite have the armorer skill required yet to repair it. We need five more armorer. So if we have a lot of ghosts in here, we're not going to be able to get through them simply because we don't have the silver weaponry required to do so. Which means, chat, we might have to come back if there's lots of ghosts. Feel like the Witcher. Silver blade for undead and monsters. Steel blade for humans and normal creatures. What the fuck? What can detect me that's a hundred feet away? Oh, this guy. I must he must have been down there and I didn't notice. Okay, we've got a skeleton guardian or champion or whatever. Hero. What? Silly butt, where are you going? Don't fucking even think about it. <laughs> Just got fucking wrecked. Silly butt was running forward into the bowels of the fortress. Didn't want him aggroing anything else in there. Oh, he already did. He aggroed a ghost. Okay, you know what? Because the ghost is here, we're going to have to run outside. And, um... Use the legionary. Well, that broke. That broke real quick. Get out of there. Oh shit, the ghost followed. The ghost followed. Where's the legionary? Help! I don't think the legionary can do anything about it because the ghost is... He only has silver, um, steel weapons, not silver. Where was he? He was headed down this way. Let's see how far he's gone. He probably went quite far, to be honest, since considering how long we were fighting the ghost for. Okay. Let's go back this way. There might be another legionary on the road somewhere up here. This is going to be a very long fight, chat. Where's he going? Oh, Legionary, nice. Oh, the Legionary can fight him, good. Oh, the Legionary fucked him up, good work, thank you. Thank you very much, much appreciated. I was never going to be able to deal with that, it was going to be a fucking nightmare to be honest. Oh, there might be something up there, actually, I haven't discovered. Let's let's uh, jump get up to there. How do we jump up to there? Let's jump up to here. And jump up here? No. I don't think we can get up there. No, I don't think we can. Nope. Nope, it's not letting me jump when I go forward here. Because I'm not standing on anything technically. Yeah, I'm still... There we go, now I've landed. Nope. Really, game? doesn't count as me landing for some reason if I zoom out see look I'm not I'm just levitating 
and I can't jump. That's a platformer. Obliv who knew Oblivion was a platformer? I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck, chat. There we go. Yeah, we can't get up there. Oh well, whatever. Can we get up from up over around here? Is there somewhere around here we can get up? It looks like there's something in there. It's a deer. Right, let's repair the weapons we can for now and get back in and kill that skeleton guardian. Where'd he go? Must have gone back. See, I can't even see this thing. Ah, where'd it go? It's just gone. Maybe it died. Maybe it despawned. Maybe it bugged out. Oh, no, there it is. Ah, I see why it can detect me, because it's 100... It's 100 feet directly below. So it can see me. It can sense me from all the way down. Anything else? Doesn't look like it. Can't get through here. That's obviously the way you come back out. Okay, I don't think they can get up to me from wherever they are. Oh shit, that's a wraith. I'll just stand here fireballing because he's just hitting stuff into the wall. He's like, this isn't working. <laughs> My God, this is going to take a long time. Maybe we should bring it outside for the guard to fight. Whoops, didn't mean to summon him. Yeah, it's coming now. This is annoying. Anything for me down here? No. Nothing down here, no. If I leave, if I start leaving for the exit, is it going to come after me? Because it's going to take forever to kill this thing, whereas the legionary outside will kill it in a couple of... kill it in a couple of hits. Are you coming or what? No, it doesn't want to. Fuck me, it just kills me in two hits. Okay, so the only way to kill it is by um, standing here, fireballing it. At 
This is literally the only way to kill it, unfortunately, chat. It's not going to come after me, so I can't take it outside and let the guard deal with it. And it's way too powerful to get close to and fight it face to face. So we're just going to have to fireball it to death, unfortunately. C'est la vie. This is why you don't go adventuring and exploring before you're powerful enough. It's, it's basically better to stick around town and just do all the quests and missions around town that you can do as you level up and become more and more powerful, such as the Thieves' Guild. Like the Thieves' Guild missions are all sneak-based missions. They're all focused around town. There's very little combat involved. And uh, you can get loads of money, acquire, you can acquire loads of money and powerful items that help you survive in the combat situations just by doing the Thieves' Guilds. Silly fool, it's a narrow corridor. You can't hit me. I can't hit you either. Okay, so he is coming now, finally. Let's go up and hide in here. <coughs> okay, now he's actually shooting at us properly. We have to leave. We have to get some space. Luckily, it's a nice, straight, long corridor, so we can just sit here fireballing him for ages. And he either has to chase us outside, at which point the Centurion, the Imperial Legionary out there will deal with him, or we just fireball him to death. Take five or ten minutes, but should be worth it, chat. Should be worth it. I can dodge your stupid fireballs all day. You can't dodge mine, dummy. You just have an infinite more amount of health. gonna follow us let's see if we can get it upstairs it's coming got a good position here again. Nope, if fire don't manage to hit over it, I guess it's because it's closer. Nope, that time it hit the wall, good.
Yes, you slam those fireballs into the wall. Nope, that one hit. Ouch, what a nasty spell. Look at my health go down. Got a gaping wound, apparently. <clears throat> Come on, take your fucking time. Got you, you bastard. Right, any silver arrows here? I need to pick them up. I'm going to need them for any more ghosts we run into. Ectoplasm is all you get. There was one. Music's still going for some reason. Must have aggroed something else. Don't tell me there's another one around this corner. That would be a fucking nightmare. What's that? What the hell is that? Oh, it's a fish. It's a slaughter fish. Just a normal slaughter fish, okay. Okay, this is the point where the water breathing is gonna come in handy. Very handy, yeah. Very, very handy. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to explore this if it weren't for the ring. Is it coming or what? The skeleton up there.
Holy shit, there's a lot of enemies. What's over here? There was a staircase up, wasn't there, somewhere? Over here? No, I miss. No, I miss. Oh, mud crabs. Ow, he can shoot me through the water? That doesn't work. Arrows would just get instantly slowed by water and just basically do nothing. Whatever. We can just hide in the water as much as we want. Damn, it's a hero again. Go around and get rid of all the mud crabs. Because I don't want them being a nuisance while we're running around. And those are slaughter fish in there, good. This is just a normal skeleton, this is a guardian. So he'll go down much more quickly than the hero, so let's take him down first. Keep sidestepping and shimmying and dodging. The guardian behind is shooting. Uh oh. The hero was shooting the guardian, which was helping his health come down. Yes. Hold your shots. Yes, keep hacking him up. Hack him up, Skeletor. Good work. Ow. Shit. Let's get the old Bruce Emilian sword out. Oh shit, another skeleton showed up. Oh shit, this isn't good. Where the fuck did he come from? Okay, one of the skeletons went down, which is good. I need his bow. I want his, oh, it's just a steel bow. Shit, not good, not good, not good. Yeah, he nailed me. Okay, that other skeleton coming in is really bad.
Because we can't hide behind the pillars now. Where did he even come from? No idea where that other skeleton came from for the second, uh, the one that killed me a second ago, but he's not here now. Skeletor, no! Damn it, it didn't have silver arrows. That's the steel bow, yeah, it is, yeah. Yes, hack him up, Skeletor. Hack him up. While I stand and draw his fire, you can fuck him in the air. Oh, shit, he's got me. He fell in the water. Ow. bow I will take. See, I don't know where that other skeleton came from. That may have been... Oh, it must have been the um, the one that despawned at the start. Or we thought despawned at the start. Just came to play out of nowhere. Dwarven arrow. Ring. Not much going on here. Not much going on here at all. No magic weapons, really. No magic weapons, really. That can't be the end of the dungeon. That better not be. I'll be so disappointed. Oh, heavy armor is almost broken. Probably should have checked that before coming in. No, it looks like it keeps going. Good. Okay. Yeah, this water breathing ring is just diamond right now. It means we can explore all the nooks and crannies, take our time making sure we're getting every bit of loot, every bit of treasure, okay, so that's the way we go. And make sure nothing is missed. Okay. Glass battle axe. That's a, worth a pretty penny. I'll take that. Thank you. I uh, thank you. Please don't tell me it's another wraith. No, it's a rat. I saw it hovering in the air. I didn't realise that. Or I thought it was a wraith. But it's actually just the stairs came up.
support major garrison blocks. Skeleton over there. Slaughterfish. Nothing else. Okay, easy. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Slaughterfish are no problem compared to the ones we fought in the lake. The Romare slaughterfish, they were a fucking nightmare. They took forever to kill. Gold necklace. Expert mortar and pestle. Nice. Okay. Something over there looks like a ghost. Another skeleton hero. Oh. Ow. That one's got a really nice bow. Or it's using silver arrows because that did so much damage in one hit. Wonder if you can paralyze skeletons. I don't think you can. I think they're immune to it. But then again, I said that about zombies. Get behind cover. I was going to pick up the arrows. They disappeared. Ow. Alright, I'll dodge his arrows, Skeletor. You, you fuck him up. You're not actually hitting him right now, Skeletor. There you go. Now you're hitting him. Wiggle, wiggle. Don't stop, wiggle, wiggle. Yeah, get up there and fuck him up. Good boy. That's a good boy. Oh, we've got a, zo we've got a zombie, don't we? I forgot. We can summon a zombie now. We can dismiss undead. That's not worth... That's not very useful. Uh, what do we got? Dismiss undead. Summon zombie is only... Uh, it's a bit shorter, but it's only... It's three more magic and it's ten seconds shorter, but zombies are way tougher and do what much more damage. So let's summon a Zomboss. Get him, zombie. Get him, Chuckles. Bosh. Tonk. Twat. Crunch. Smash. See, he took two shots. The zombie took three hits there and was still alive. So that's one shot. Two shots. Oh, and he fucking killed it. Yeah, the zombie's amazing. Nice. What was it? Elven bow. Okay. And silver arrows. That's what it was doing. Yeah, elven bow combined with silver arrows was what was killing us so fucking quickly. Okay, anything here? I don't think so. 
Don't think so. No, 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 no. Just need to repair our weapons. Oh, the list of death can go. Ramblings of Odin's Oridius can go. Repair hammer. Oh shit, it's a ghost. It's a wraith as well. Oh, bollocks. That's annoying. I might sneak past it. I can't see what's ahead though. If it was another chamber, that like a secluded chamber, I'd sneak past it. Unfortunately, it's now we've in the we're in a bad position. It's coming at us from. It's coming at us from a really good position where it's. Um, oh shit! Now I'm in trouble. I'll bring it up here and then I'll sneak past it, I think. That's the best option. We're not going to be able to... Well, we will be able to kill it eventually, but it'll be a really hard... Really long, really arduous, drawn out battle of dodging spell, dodging, dodging fireballs, or dodging its attacks and launching fireballs at it. And I really can't be asked to do that, so we're just going to sneak past it. Doesn't know where we've gone. Come in here, close the doors. Shouldn't have done that, now it knows where I am. Whoops. Yeah, now it's following. Shouldn't have closed the doors. Well, it's pretty slow moving, so we can just do this. Zombie. Shadow banish wine, nice. Greater Staff of Burden, Dwarven Greaves. Very nice. Ow, what the fuck? One hit. It's a Dread Zombie. Yeah, Dread Zombie. Okay, these are seriously powerful undead. Okay, that's just a normal ghost. We can't fight all these undead. There's too many of them, they're too powerful. Let's just get in here, get the loot. That zombie is on fucking speed. Great, skeleton archer up there as well. Chainmail, wormwood leaves. Oh shit. Lucky that missed. Zombie almost killed us. Right, I need to ghost walk through this door. So that they don't know where I am. And they don't follow. He followed. Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Ah! Okay, well we got all the loot. Seriously powerful undead in there. 
We got most of the loot. I would have liked to kill that skeleton. Yeah, this guy's coming. Let's bring him outside, see if the Imperial soldier's still around. We might be able to go back in, actually, once this guy's dead. Bring him outside. We can hide on a rock. It'll take forever to kill him, but... Hopefully the Imperial Guard's around here somewhere. There's usually Imperial Watchmen patrolling this road. So... There's a barrel here. I didn't notice that before. Zomon versus zombie. Wow, our zombie actually survives a few hits from a dread zombie. Let's go find a legionary. He'll be able to deal with this. Then we can go back in, kill the ghost, kill the skeleton. <laughs> There's just this fucking zombie chasing us all the way down the road. It's so funny. <laughs> There's a deer. I thought it was a legionary. Come on. Where are the legionaries? Any legionaries anywhere? No, just deer. Just deer chat, just deer. Okay, well, fuck it. I don't want to keep running because I'll eventually discover a another ruin, basically. Let's see if we can turn this guy. Uh, where is it? Turn undead. Do I even have enough? Can I even use it yet? Dismiss undead. No, conjuration is 75. What is our conjuration? Sixty, okay. We could just go right. We could just go straight across to the Imperial City. I think I'm going to do that. Because I don't want to discover any more ruins that I then can't explore with this guy on my tail. This thing will kill us in a couple of hits. We could jump up a rock and just fireball it, I suppose. But it's going to take a long time. I'd much sooner just run away. Fuck this, it's going to take forever. Let's come down here, see if there's any Nern root. Ah. Ow. My ankle! <laughs> I twisted my ankle and I can't run away now, chat. <laughs> I'm going to get et by a zombie. No Nern root, huh? And it's waning. Oh, Nern root over there. And this is one of the shrines that we have to pray to anyway. Stendar. Oh, we don't have to. We have, I haven't got the anvil thing yet, so I can't even do that. I haven't been to anvil yet, chat. Is it still following us? No, I think we lost it. Yeah, peaceful music has returned, chat. Okay. Uh, let's go to the Imperial City. We need to get all our stuff repaired. We need to sell everything. Man, that zombie. That that place was fucking dangerous at the end. What do you mean the prey approaches? What are you talking about? Right. Welcome to a Fighting chance. She Thank has you. the most money out of everyone in the market. As far as I'm aware, she has the most amount of money to offer out of everyone in the market, so she's a good person to butter up and get to high to get high um, personality with. Because she, so she likes horizontal, she hates That's vertical. Real. What not really? Oh please. Hates not vertical, now. likes oh, horizontal. You. Oh, that's great. That's that. Not now. Well. You can't scare me. You can't oh, scare not. me. With your waist. You're good. I am good. Disposition max. Now we go to this and we 
Hunt, no, not Hunter's Sight. What is it? Enthralling Presence her as well. So now she's even more charmed by me. She's 89% charmed. So that means we can sell at to her at like 60%, I reckon. Uh, we want to sell the Dwarven Bow. That's just not no, too much. 52. Sorry, 58. Take two off. You need to make no. it better. Down to 55 then. No, no, 55 please. Thank you. Yeah, good, 55 it is. Glass Battle Axe, we're going to sell that, definitely. It's not magic. Elven Bow can go. Greater Staff of Burden. Meh. Don't care. Don't care. Dwarven Greaves. Uh, and we want to repair stuff. If I can't fix it, it ain't broke. Bruce Amelian Sword needs repairing. Tower of the Nine needs repairing. There's only one gold, so we'll just repair that rather than replacing it. And the Steel Longsword we can... Um, Steel Longsword we can repair ourselves. Okay. So we've sold everything. We've repaired everything. Jewel of Ramari, we can take off, put that on instead again now. Uh, Expert Mortar and Pestle, we want to uh, put away. Actually, only weighs a pound, so we want to keep it on us. So we probably just want to sell everything else. Yeah, okay. Any news? Only not yet lady stop badgering on about it she is maxed out on disposition so we can haggle her up to like 69 i think 70 percent we can get to let's try it make me a better offer no 68 i can't make that deal 66 that's more than yeah nice you got a great deal there. Silver amulet, silver sapphire ring, loads of gold that stuff. Seems a fair price. Cure paralysis, resist frost, strong poison. Yeah, get rid of the poison of burden. Potion of dispel. Potion of fortune. Exoplasms. Mort flesh is really heavy, so get rid of that. Bound gauntlets, yeah, can go. Drain skill, heavy armor can go. And that's that. Thank Thanks again. You are welcome again for my help. Go to the Guild of Craft, sell our pest. Oh, fuck it, it's only like 25 gold, isn't it? Novice Morton Pestle can be dropped. How many? We've still got zero uses. Okay. We need to recharge. How do you. Is it here in the Mystic Emporium that they can recharge weapons? I think it is. What do you. No. Who can recharge in magical weapons in the Imperial City? Maybe this guy. Considering he's got magical staffs, you'd think it would be the case. You're in Rindir's staffs. Nope, he doesn't recharge magic items. That's Let's really surprising. Business. Right, guys. Well, that's it for this episode. We have come to the end of things. I'm going to wrap things up there for now. Thank you so much for hanging out and watching today, guys. I do hugely appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed as much as I've enjoyed playing. Let's just check to see if this guy has any new magic items we want to buy. Because they're usually changing. I offer the finest goods Helmet of and power. prices in all series. Nice. For 2.5k, a steel helmet that gives 15 points of magicka. I think I'll buy that. Yeah, I'm going to buy that. Helmet of power. Bargain at any price.
Maybe. Nice. Oh wait, what did, what business. level were we haggling at? Fifty six. Yeah, that's pretty much the best we can get off him, isn't it? Tell yeah. Me more. Oh no, he's a hundred percent. I'm gonna. You too. Well, whatever, chat. I'm gonna end the episode there. I'll load it and uh, get, haggle him down a bit and get a bit of gold saved. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I'm gonna be back tomorrow morning with another episode of Oblivion. Hopefully I will see you all there for that. If not, I'll try and catch you in some other content I produce. I try and make content every single day now. So, so wait till next time.